He is the retired judge whose task is to determine the truth about one of Britain's worst disasters. Sir Martin Morbick today viewed the flowers left for the victims of Grenfell Tower. But there are questions about whether he's the best person for the job ahead of him. And even Sir Martin had concerns about what an inquiry can actually achieve. Well, I've been asked to undertake this inquiry on the basis that it would be pretty well limited to the uh, problems surrounding the start of the fire and its rapid development uh, in order to make recommendations as to how this sort of thing can be prevented in the future. Now, I'm well aware that uh, the residents uh, and, and the uh, local people want a much broader investigation and I can fully understand why they would want that. Uh, whether my inquiry is the right way in which to achieve that, I'm more doubtful. Despite his concerns, the government has always said Sir Martin will consult survivors and victims' families about the inquiry's terms of reference shortly. He hopes to have a preliminary report out within a year, answering questions about how the fire started and how it spread. The man whose career spans 50 years has today been described as highly respected and hugely experienced by the Prime Minister. But in one of his most controversial cases, Sir Martin ruled a single mother could be rehoused 50 miles from her inner city home. As he left a meeting with residents, he stressed that ruling doesn't impact his well, new I'm role. Com you compromised at all, sir, by Absolutely previous rulings? Not. No. What about these previous rulings? People say you're not fit to do this inquiry. Well, I don't agree with them. And what have you reassured residents today? I've discussed uh, all aspects of the matter with residents. I've been mainly concerned to get their side of the story uh, and to hear what they have to say, and they've been very helpful. But one resident told Five News he wasn't sure Sir Martin was the best choice. His background seems to be commercial, maritime and insurance law. You know, I understand he's dealt with quite complex fires on things like oil tankers. I also understand that this is pretty much unprecedented, but I don't think that he has the right background to lead the whole inquiry. He admits his inquiry could prove challenging. Residents want answers to basic questions quickly.